guys, uh, my name is Slavek and uh, I represent the Carbon Fox Group and I want to clarify today a lot of the rumors about the carbon skid plates, bash plates uh, and the difference behind the material who we are using and the opinion about the carbon fiber uh, about the, the, the stiffness and the resistance for the stress uh, I try to explain what's going on. I have in hand a uh, very old skid plate who was uh, been used in the Dakar race uh, two years ago. Uh, this skid plate still is in one piece. Uh, why? Uh, I want to explain this. Because it is not pure carbon. Inside this uh, material, we have a lot of the different layers of the material. Uh, inside is the Kevlar, it's a science name, it's Aramide, who have a bulletproof uh, resistance for the stress. Uh, what is important? Uh, carbon fiber gives us the stiffness. Kevlar inside, uh, protect the surface on the very high shock and the dynamic stress. What we have uh, on the end, very, very heavy duty the parts, who is not heavy. Um, when we compare the aluminium uh, to carbon fiber, uh, skid plate it is minimum two times less weights uh, good example is this one have a, a weight 1400 grams uh, similar st uh, things uh, this size made from the four millimeter aluminium uh, have a minimum three kilo um, about the endurance this part I don't have a, a bad words because, uh, like you see, um, uh, our racer changed this skid plate from only one reason. Looks ugly because it's old, have a lot of the drops, nothing else. Uh, but um, a few thousand kilometers on the stone desert show how strong is it. And now, please uh, follow me, I want to show you something, maybe it will be a little bit dangerous, but I try to explain how it works. Okay, uh, this is a two kilo uh, hammer, so not uh, small things. Uh, I would like to show you how it works. <laughs> 